Hello everyone, this is WiseGuy91 again. I am playing Minecraft Beta 1.8 and I just updated today to 1.81. Um, I've messed around a little bit on here. I made a uh, 1.8 survival mode which will be a um, just typical survival. I have that MC edit tutorial from before, um, something else I was working on. And I decided to use my name as a seed for the first time and made 1.8 WiseGuy in a survival mode and uh, found out that it's actually a very good seed um, you can do that by hitting create new world type in whatever you want for more world options I literally just typed wise guy and um, hit create new world at the bottom there and um, I made this map here now basically you spawn in uh, a tree area with vines and right next to a river um, if you turn to the right, I believe it is, there's a desert area and an NPC village right there. It's sitting right on the beach. It's laid out very well, actually. It doesn't have things cut off as much. Um, a lot of farmland there. And then there's an island um, out of the crystal to water. I decided to swim out towards that island. That turned out to be a whole other land chunk. And um, started following a river. And that's where I'm at right here. It's going to be nighttime, I believe. Apologize. Um, I am using too many items. Uh, that's how I have all of this stuff here, basically. Um, credits go out to that guy. I mean, great mod. Uh, let me go ahead and sleep real quick. Just make it dead time. But basically, I started following that river that you see there. And uh, decided to go up this hill here. And look what I found. So, nice river. Love the new level generator. The new chunk generator is amazing. But, um, yeah, decided to come up here some and found this little opening. I said, huh, well, I've seen a couple other ones like this. I like exploring them some. Sometimes there's just random drops and everything. And uh, I checked this one out some and jumped down. And um, I saw this and I got really excited. So if you don't see that right there, my cursor is uh, the new stone brick and mossy stone brick, which is only used in strongholds. So, uh, I found my first stronghold. So I jumped down and, uh, I don't know, I tried to mine around a little bit. It looked like I was just sitting kind of on top of it. And, um, you know, I couldn't really do too much, so I decided to go ahead and come down here and, uh, mine right into the stairway, which leads down to the stronghold. And this is just the coolest thing ever. So I want to make a real quick video, um, just at the entrance here. I'm going to actually stop it and uh, come. Uh, you know what? I'm going to go ahead and explore. Why not? I have some other stuff I have to get done. Sorry about the lag, by the way. Uh, 1.8 does lag for me, just like it is with everyone else when they're recording. So um, let's check this thing out. As you can see, I didn't place anything here. Anything in the stronghold you see was all completely naturally, uh, naturally spawned with a chunk generator. So they made that staircase there. They put in the cracked brick blocks. All of this here, the mossy. They put in the doors. They put in the iron bars, um, iron doors here. This iron door is open, and there's no redstone anywhere. So you can see that that was actually, you know, loaded in the world open. Um, there's a lot of stuff that does this type of thing. Just kind of comes around and loops to the same door. Um, some of these doors were closed and opened already. So that goes back to where we started. Um, yeah, that just loops around to here. I walked around some, but I really didn't do too much. This place is just huge. Uh, here's the famous library. Um, I haven't gone down there yet. You can see the spider web's still there. Iron bars down here, so you can see there's something going on down there. You know, they they put in a torch here already. Here's the library that are found in strongholds now. Uh, cobwebs throughout because you know it's all abandoned and everything. Really cool stuff. Um, Try not to get stuck in cobweb. And I did. Oh, there's a ladder over here. So I've seen some people renovate strongholds and turn them into houses online, and they look freaking amazing. So awesome chandelier, all completely built by the chunk generation system. That's why there's torches on blocks that aren't there. Um, I mean, torches on top of fence posts and stuff like that. Like, that just looks awesome, I think. I might steal that idea. Oh, there's a little chest over here, too some more books and paper <laughs> so uh, just really cool really loving this um, as soon as I saw it I knew I had to stop the video or excuse me stop playing and just go ahead and start filming 
So this is going to be in 1080p again. Um, I try to film in HD up to 1080p. Um, I play on a one screen monitor that supports 720 output, so it actually upconverts to 1080 using a Camtasia Studio. Um, let's see what else is around here. There's more light over here. Oh, little door with a button that I filled. Watch, I can't get it through. Oh, okay, no, there's a button there. It's like, watch, I'm going to get locked over here instead. That would suck. Uh, okay, more torch, little stairway stuff. Huh. Some type of wooden floor above me and little... I don't know what that is. I don't want to mine anything right now just because I don't want to break this perfect... perfectness. <laughs> So there's a button here, and there's a button on the other side as well, but that door's stuck open. So I'm not great with redstone, but I think because it has two inputs, maybe that's why it's always open. But the other one didn't have any buttons, so... Oh. Okay. So it's just a little design there for this chest. We got some apples, more iron ingots. I love the new chest animation too, by the way. If you haven't seen it yet, it, it like opens and closes. I'll show you later, probably. Um, oh. Okay, more staircase. And this staircase doesn't go anywhere. Okay. So uh, eventually Notch has said that he wants to have um, NPCs in NPC villages, and he wants to have uh, bosses and mobs in strongholds, where you actually uh, fight a stronghold boss. Um, right now I have it put on peaceful so I can film without uh, interruption, but there would be mobs all over this place, I'm sure if I uh, did not have it on peaceful right now. So I'm literally just running around. I have no idea where I'm at. Um, no idea where the entrance was. I could probably find it if I really tried. I'd have to find that library and go back from there. Um, just going to keep going down this way. As I see staircases, I'm going to try to get lower and see what I can find. Got that little loop area. Oop, another staircase. And... Wow. Okay, so I've heard of this before, too. Um, the world does not look at strongholds as separate objects right now. Um, you actually can have like mine shafts going right through them and this is a dungeon that was spawned into the stronghold it looks like. So uh, you can see the spider spawner there. Um, it's not spawned anything. You saw a little poof a second ago. That's because I'm on peaceful. But the spawner is still there. Which is nice. Okay, that just loops back around. So that's a uh, very interesting, good to know. And I'm lagging again, sorry about that. Wow, and again. Yeah, sometimes uh, 1.8 gets a little laggy like that. Sorry about that, guys. Man, what the heck is going on? There we go. A little choppy. So if you do type in the seed, um, wise guy, there's the coordinates right there. Uh, you can see the seed is negative four three five four one eight three zero six or if you just type in wise guy capital w capital g um, there's the xyz coordinates of where i'm currently at obviously if you bring the z up then you'd probably dig straight down into the stronghold anywhere in this area so eight oh six thirty four negative two six two pretty cool i'm loving it oh man that's an awesome place okay let's go this way Oh, cool, a little jail cell. Iron doors with iron bars, and they're separated too. That's pretty sweet. There's a wooden door on this side, and there's no separation from the cells, so I guess you can just escape if you're on that half, but uh, that's right. I mean, it's not perfect yet. Um, like I said, I think they're saying like 1.9, maybe 1.10, they want to have uh, villagers and NPCs and stuff like that, so maybe we'll have... Um, NPCs locked up in there. That'd be pretty interesting. Ah, oh man, this lag is killing me. I don't know why it's doing this. It's probably generating new chunks. I haven't been all around here yet. Okay, let's go back up. Let's go out this way. I don't think we've been this way yet. There's a door open, but this doesn't always mean anything because some of these doors were open to begin with. I think I came this way. I don't know. Maybe not. <laughs> you guys can tell me. But um, anyway, guys, I'm going to go ahead and explore this place a little bit more on my own. If I find anything else cool, I'll uh, add it to the video. But I think I'm going to stop it here. Here's towards the beginning again. 
yeah, I think I'll go ahead and stop it here. Um, you can mine all of this stuff away. This is the only place you can get uh, the mossy stone brick, I believe. You can't, like, take vine and combine it with mossy brick. Sorry about that. That's my dog. But, um, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, subscribe, like, comment, tell me what you like. I'm going to continue the MC edit tutorials soon and um, a lot more 1.8 videos. Alright, so have a great day. Thanks again. Bye.